Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to No Man's Sky Worlds. We're on the Aquarius Expedition Part 2. Yeah, I still have that ship. Uh, we're going to go to the next star system here shortly. Uh, I was getting uranium and tried to finish the, uh, the planet there. Uh, I think it was uranium. Yeah, it was radioactive. Anyway, uh, I scanned one of the animals and it turned out to weigh over a hundred kilograms. Uh, for that, we got five halo cores and a deathly cold ice cream. I'm not sure that's edible. <laughs> it says it's edible. Uh, let's uh, put these halo cores in. Here's another 250. We have just enough, I think, just enough nanites to get that uh, ship and uh, turn off my flashlight. There we go. Oh boy, I'm telling you too, I really would like to finish this. Um, where is it? Uh, there it is right there. It's... Uh, 3,000 nanites. If I could just find this one underground creature. And I spent a good deal of time doing that, too. Alright, let's uh, go to the next star system. I don't know how long it's going to take us to get to the next rendezvous. How far away it is. Um, appears to be quite far in that direction. Alright. Let's do it. Well, uh, uh, did I, I wonder if I sold it. I think I sold everything that was extra. I also picked up salt and crystal sulfide and living pearls. And we'll definitely stop here. I don't have a lot of money. That's a big deal. I have uh, uh, 169,000. Uh, so yeah, I've got some stuff here for uh, making the fishing equipment. That can go over there too while we're traveling. When we go to change ships, it's going to be tricky though. I don't know where I'm going. Uh, let's see here. Ferrite. And... Da -da 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 I don't think... Oh, we could have just bought salt. <laughs> Alright. I have a ton of nav data. This is mercenaries. It didn't even cross my mind that I might, oh nice, that I might actually find uh, the uh, heavy animal. <laughs> I was just trying to make nanites so that I could buy my uh, Utopia speeder. This ship uh, is special, it has a name. The Celeste, and that that matters. Oh, you know what? I might not have enough fuel. We'll, we'll find out, I guess. I mean, uh, hyperdrive fuel, of course. Oh, yeah, I do. There we go. Stubbery. <laughs> We're going to Stubbery. It is super past lunchtime, but I spent so much time getting that fuel and probably 45 minutes searching for all the animals on that planet. And then, uh, oh, it looks interesting. Secret fishing spot. All right, let's go up here first. We have to wait for all this stuff to clear through. Nanites acquired. Uh, and it told me right at the bottom of that list in the lower right corner that I could go to the anomaly. 
just we were just waiting on all that stuff clearing and should I get another suit slot I think so I don't know why there's a dollar bill sign on that uh, <laughs> exosuit dude have you got some uh, dollar bills for me <laughs> uh, let's see here 15,000 units. Oh, whatever. It's fine. Why do you have a dollar bill sign on your head? Is it because you want me to spend nanites on you? After I get my ship. Then I'll have like a hundred nanites left. <laughs> I want to check to and uh, see if I have to actually purchase the nutrient processor uh, or um, or what's up with that because it the way that I read it uh, last time it sounded like I have to actually buy the nutrient processor but uh, I didn't take any time to actually look at the rewards for anything research terminals. I definitely don't want to get anything uh, that the game is going to give me. So we're going to have to do a little bit of shuffling here. Oh yeah, I don't have any energy either. <laughs> Howdy. Uh, the Utopia Speeder is an expedition reward, unfortunately. So, uh, if you weren't around for the Utopia expedition... Did I pass it? There it is. Um, then you will have uh, missed out on this ship. But there's uh, other cheaper ships that you can just buy that are in-game. Alright, uh, let's see. we got that. Let's transfer all of that to the ship. And then we can uh, call in the other ship. I don't know where I picked up the repair kit, but that's cool. I don't think you can use it for things that are um, uh, not built. I think you can only use it on things that are uh, sort of not uh, repaired. Things that are broken, rather. Um, do I want a pew pew gun? I don't know. Alright, now we can transfer all of this stuff. And then we'll get the essentials for life back. And let's see here. That would be the first stuff. There's oxygen, carbon, ferrite, carbon plus. Um, I thought I had a uh, ion battery left over. We'll just make a few of them. I have one to hydrogen jelly. <laughs> There's two of those for emergencies. Alright, so let's go rearrange some stuff here and uh, take a look at the rewards and see if we have to actually purchase anything while we're here. So uh, first of all, let's uh, move some stuff around out of the way. One of these is the thing that I need. There we go. <laughs> uh, let's see here. There's 10. 11. 1100 is pretty good. Plate of armor goes over there. Hyperdrive. We'll put that down there. Alright. Pretty 
pretty good, except this is always a mess. Uh, if it drives you too much crazy, you can put your difficulty uh, on uh, purchases that are free and just go in and fix it, but I don't really like to do that too much. All right, phase one. Uh, let's see, reward fishing rig plans. Uh, f uh, next thing is uh, underwater oxygen upgrade. Aqua jets, nice. Nutrient processor plans. We don't need to buy those things. B movement upgrades. Sorry, I was in the middle of a hiccup there. Life support, hazard protection. Uh, more inventory slots, fishing bait recipes. Launch auto charger. Uh, that's nice. Advanced mining laser, that'll come in handy. What do we need for that? Catch an uncommon fish. Uh, let's see. Hazard protection. Uh, actual bait. Craftable components plans. I'm not sure what we're going to need them for, but here's the exoskiff. That's in phase two. So it looks like everything uh, that we need for fishing is in the rest of phase one and phase two. And then uh, we're going to do a bunch of fishing. There's some starship slots right there. Uh, there's the trap. We, we'll need that trap. Uh, it's going to give us, after it gives us all of the plans for, that we need sulfide and, and all of that stuff for, then it's going to give us sulfide. <laughs> That's pretty typical of an expedition in No Man's Sky to get the things after you need them. Is that... Uh, oh, protection upgrade for thermal, for frost, and ooh, rocket boots. That's pre-packaged. We don't have to build that. Yes, seven inventory slots. Very nice. There's some uh, shadow lures, quicksilver, uh, barnacle plans. Thirty salvage data. That's a lot of money. Very cool. Uh, this uh, way of doing the expedition creates a new save. So um, if you want a normal mode save and you want to do the expedition, start with the expedition, it'll give you all of this amazing stuff. And then you go on and it converts to normal after the expedition. And then, uh, oh yeah, we encrypted lots and lots of Quicksilver. 20 more crystal sulfide. It's a good thing we got a bigger ship because it's going to take a bigger ship. All right, we need to put this on uh, right there and get on going. Yeah, now we're flying a real ship. That away. <laughs> Ancient bones. That's a lot of money. We're going to a lush, which is really nice. It is going to have storms, though. So we'll have to watch out for that. Reach the first rendezvous. Indeed. Secret fishing spot. This angler guy seems to have gone fishing. <laughs> Things went badly from there. <laughs> Let's see if this com ball has anything to do with what we need to do. Oh boy, there's a lot of com balls. <laughs> I don't see anything that's like here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> There's got to be a place to land. Hey, there's uh that looks like uh, that is not what that is. All right, 420 units. That way. Oh my goodness, there's bugs here. Bug, bug, bug. 420 units this way. Must be on the other shore. I don't actually see anything though. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that 
that way. I'm gonna drown. <laughs> Greetings, Chicago. Alright. Lots of bugs. Big bugs. Little bugs. <laughs> There's a base over there. You'd think a secret fishing uh, spot would be, you know, at a fishing spot. Someone lovely put a uh, base right on the uh, uh, rendezvous point. The angler's cache. I rummaged through the cache's rusty innards. It appears to contain a schematic for a piece of fishing equipment. Very cool. All right, gone fishing. There we go. I need a dihydrogen jelly. I hope I have another one left. Uh, 12 species, boy. I'll tell you what, I did that on the last planet. Oh, hello. Of course, two or three of the species are going to be bugs. What's that? Oh, natural burial site. Very cool. All right, everything is in the ship. Let's grab a save here. There's all kinds of uh, evil plants of evil here. There it is. Oh, there's even old-fashioned bugs. Gigantic crabs. Subterranean relics. Here's another bird. Oh, about a little tiny bug. That's cool. Uh, metal fingers. I think you need an advanced mining beam for that. I think I sold all of my, uh, sweet root and stuff. This seems like a crazy idea. I don't think that I'm going to be, uh, launching into the uh, space below me. <laughs> oh, hello. Loots! I really can't help myself, you guys. Well, that was all those bugs. Uh, I don't think that will have a uh, the hydrogen in it. This is all cash money, <laughs> if we're lucky. Oh, there's another microprocessor. I was thinking about putting in uh, the um, economy scanner, but I didn't pick it up. I'm not so sure we need it. Oh, all of the bugs are the same species. Okay. That's probably par for the course. This is a super pretty planet. I really like this color. Loads and loads of calm balls. Oh, 
Well, uh, yeah, I think I scanned those already. Oh, the seas are a little rough here. Uh, I don't know if, um, that, uh, big, uh, uh, fish, it's actually a crab is what it, what it was. If that big crab on the desert planet or the gamma planet in the first system is like the best option for finding an animal over 100 kilograms, it was rare. Um, there we go. <laughs> no, that's, I meant to get the hadal core. Did I get the hadal core? <laughs> I hope so. That certainly seems like it would be. No, it's only 84 kilograms. Yeah, 84. What about the other fish? Are they the same? I'm sure I scanned two different fish here. Yeah, they're both 84 kilograms. All right, we're drowning. <laughs> Let's see if we have uh, enough for dihydrogen jelly. All right. Uh, oops, wrong button. Uh, there we go. Fishing rig plans. There's a lot of signals here. Sometimes these uh, signals can really mess with your uh, expedition rewards. So if you're having problems getting your rewards, just remember that that can be a thing. All right. We need dihydrogen. I do not have any uh, because I made that. <laughs> Let's put the hail core in. <laughs> uh, it's only 50 nanites, but every little bit, you know. Okay. There's some dihydrogen right there. Let's go get that. It can be really hard to see on a on a lush planet, so it's best to just use the scan there. There we go. Oh, that's empty completely. And oh yeah, and some uh, carbon nanotubes. There we go. All right, fishing gear. Oh, the chromatic metals on the ship. Ouch. <laughs> All right, we can now fish. Very cool. Test the fishing rod. Uh, locate a suitable body of water. This, in fact, is a suitable body of water. There we go. And then uh, you use the uh, left mouse button for this. I think. Except that sometimes it doesn't seem to work. There we go. The inky depths. The depths. <laughs> I plumbed the abyss. <laughs> we'll just wait and see about this fish. We'll catch something, no doubt about it. Uh-oh. It's going to get hot in here. Oh boy. Here we go. Yeah. Very cool. We got a needle fish. Boy, it got dark and hot very quickly. Uh, this doesn't seem to be very hot. It was either the shortest storm in history or something else is going on. <laughs> Maybe it hasn't started yet. <laughs> okay. So uh, now we're going to get underwater oxygen upgrade 
and uh, underwater survival blueprints. Here we go. The uh, rerouter and the water jets are nice. I think the water jets make it so you practically don't need um, oxygen underwater. They recharge your, uh, uh, or the rerouter or something recharges your oxygen. Uh, if you're using it, you have to use your jetpack key for that to work. And uh, let's see what's next. Next up, uh, catch five fish in a hot storm. It seems un. Oh, we've got a shield. No wonder we weren't being bothered by it. All right. Let's see if we have time to catch four more fish. There we go. You see that spot on the water? If that spot on the water isn't appearing, you can't cast your line. So we'll just stand here and uh, get fried by this superheated uh, rainstorm in the dark. <laughs> catch, catch a four more fish <clears throat> before the end near. I don't mind this update. I'm not sure it's practical, but I don't mind it at all. <laughs> they want to get us out on the water and there we go. A uh, rockin' fish. <laughs> Trying to get it out as far as I can. There we go. Alright. There we go. I do uh, quite a bit of fishing. Nice! Got an A-class fish. Uh, I do quite a bit of fishing in uh, other um, survival games like subsistence. And uh, Sunken Land, the fishing is kind of a mini game, so it's not very much fun. There we go. That is good news, suit lady. I don't think we caught a stormfish. Uh, you need to catch stormfish, but uh, I didn't get an indication that we did. <laughs> Here's a B-class fish. A non-fish fish we needed. Caught five fish. Very cool. Alright, let's see what we got. Uh, Prepackaged aqua jets. Fantastic. I love the word prepackaged. <laughs> In any expedition, prepackaged is awesome. We're going to need uh, a hermetic seal and two metal plates. So let's see here. Hermetic seal and uh, two metal plates. And the rest of that is on the shippo. So we should be able to just drop that right down. And we can go into inventory and uh, store all of that, plus the food. So all of the fish is in there. That A-class uh, fish was a moon turtle, a rare fish. I thought we needed a rare fish for something. Catch of the day. Cook, cook your catch. Uh, does it specifically say which kind? Uh, it doesn't really. So let's just grab out um, a C-class fish and then we'll drop that in there. There we go. See how the uh, com balls are interfering with the announcements there? And we'll grab that. There we go. And let's see, where is prepackaged aqua jets? There we go. It probably go over there. It doesn't have synergy. 
Uh, life support, nice. Uh, more hazard protection. There we go. Let's see if it's any better. Yeah, that's better. And uh, the last thing was to catch something that's not a fish. Well, I did. I caught a starfish, but it didn't seem to count. Uh, but that's all right. Uh, when we come back next time, we'll work on that at the uh, next rendezvous. I do hope you all have a lovely evening. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day.